Shep, you may not know that the Dream Cruise, which went on the last couple of days, was started in 1995 as a fundraiser for a soccer field in Ferndale and has since mushroomed into this huge event. Suburban Detroit dweller Justin Verlander is a noted car guy. He tweeted out yesterday that he was walking around, probably incognito, admiring the cars. He has several of them, several really nice vehicles, but not an oldie but goodie yet. You know, I've been saying I wanted a classic car for a long time now, and um, it's like I just can't make up my mind. It's like walking up and down the, uh, the Woodward Cruise. It's like I see one, and I see another one, and I see another one. It's like, God, they're all so beautiful. Um, I, I honestly just cannot bring myself to choose uh, exactly what I, what I like just yet. If you had your druthers, though, I mean, is it, you know, is it a particular model? Is it a certain era? Is it 50s, 60s? Uh, I'd, I'd say probably 60s, uh, late 60s. Um, man, there's just so many, uh, you know, obviously uh, the, the Corvettes are, are gorgeous, but I don't fit in those. You know, the, the convertible ones. First like, world problems, right? Yeah, I mean, the, the, with the big steering wheel, I can't even get my legs under the steering wheel. So uh, the first one I saw that I really, that I really loved, uh, I went to go sit in it, and I was like, well, that's not going to work. Um, you know, I, uh, Ford GTs, um, you know, the, the Chevelles. Uh, man, it's just, yeah, I, I, I really enjoy it. I, I love the, the, the grittiness of those old muscle cars, too, the sound and, uh, you know, just hearing them rumble by and, uh, you know, it, it's not like the, the, the cars you have now where everything's like perfect. These things, they, they need a little love.